Hello and welcome to the short video tutorial on searching risk management forms and exporting them to CSV. The search forms function in risk management forms enables a search to be performed for forms that have been added to the system. Click on the search forms to open the risk management search window. Then you can select the fields to be searched. This allows you to enter keywords or phrases that you are looking for. You then have to select a field from the drop down box if you wish to refine the search to specific fields. On the top of the page, you can see the search for box on the risk form management page. If you do a general search, for example, by name, you may end up with too many results. By refining your search, you are more likely to find the form you are looking for. If another field is required for the search, click on add another field. All existing forms that match criteria entered will be displayed and can be opened by clicking on the link under Form ID in the search result window. Alternatively, the forms can be exported to a CSV file in Excel by clicking on the Download this report in CSV. CSV refers to a data format file in Excel. This function in Gemba allows information in the risk management forms to be exported to a data file in Excel spreadsheet format. This allows the information to be presented in a chart or graph for reporting purposes. To export all risk management forms, select the Export to CSV in the Risk Management Forms window. The Risk Management CSV export window will open and you then need to click on the Download this report in CSV. The File Download dialog box will then open and you can either select to open or save. I will now demonstrate this process in Gemba. Click on the risk management icon and then risk forms. You can hit search at the top of the page. I will search for risk and hit enter. After this results come up, I can select to download this report in CSV and open or save the file. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach out to Kaizen Synergy. Thank you for listening to this short video tutorial.